Hey everybody, welcome back to the DWF. It's your host Dan, Dan, a wrestle fan here, and today we're giving a shout out to Bailey and Cody Rhodes. Congratulations, guys, on winning your uh, respective rumbles last night. Uh, not. I wasn't expecting Bailey. I honestly thought it was going to come down to like Bianca Belair or Becky Lynch, and I'm really glad that they did not get another opportunity. I'm, I, no offense to Bianca and Becky, but I'm just kind of sick of seeing them in title opportunities all the time. I think Bailey going after Rhea would be kind of cool. That's definitely interesting. Not what I was expecting at all. Cody Rhodes kind of saw that one coming. When it came down to Cody Punk, it's like, yeah. Everyone thought it was going to be one of these two. The only way Cody gets to fight Roman is if he wins. So, other than that, they're on two different brands. So, I don't know how they would have set that back up. So, Cody kind of had to win that. Uh, Punk can still get Seth Rollins if Seth is recovered and ready to go by Mania. And our newest sub is still the Unknown Yes. I think this is our newest sub a week ago. But that's still our newest sub. So, there we have it. So, guys, let's take a look. We've got... United States Champion Kenny Omega representing the Treasure Toy Troops, the Treasure Trove Toy Store. I'm sorry, I always mess that up. Uh, you know, bringing the card down with him as he's coming down to defend his United States Championship. He saw it done last week. He's like, hey, I can do that. But let's see who he's up against. Starting off with Purple Power Bomb, we have Batista, Junkyard Dog, Farouk. How about some X Pack and Lex Luger? Moving right on up. To Rowdy Red, Luchasaurus, Hurricane, Mark Henry, Matt Jackson, and Karrion Cross. Keeping it going, we've got Top Rope Orange with Hangman, Adam Page, The Great Kali, Eddie Kingston, Dexter Loomis, and Matt Riddle. Moving, keeping it moving along, we've got Gut Wrench Green, who has Lince Dorado, Xavier Woods, Buddy Murphy, Buddy Matthews, uh, Wesley and Sammy Guevara. Moving on up, it's your team, the AGF, with Mustafa Ali, Hook, Dan Housen, Neville, and, oh, I almost knocked over some of the characters here, and Keith Lee. Moving right up, we've got Pink Punch with R Truth, Rob Gronkowski, I almost messed that one up too, Montez Ford, Andrade, and Daniel Bryan Danielson. Finally, battling blue. Bringing it home with Jey Uso, Mr. T, a spot for the champion, Drew McIntyre, and Ricky Steamboat. That's right, guys. That is the competition. That's the field. That's what we're going to see Kenny Omega battle his way through. Not the easiest uh, group of challengers for him today, but he, like I said, he's seen the title defended before. He thinks he can do it. Let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, there we go. What a sweep them. We've already got Mr. T. Instant elimination right off the bat. I've got to move these sets. This was the whole Mount Rushmore thing and some of my, like, you guys saw it. I've got to try and keep them out of the way so they don't get hit in the field of fire here. Uh, so now let's take a look at the damage and see who's with us, who is not. Looks like Steamboat is safe. At the expense of Drew McIntyre, who will be leaving us. Montez Ford will be leaving. Drew McIntyre was on top of him. Uh, Gronk will be leaving. Truth will be leaving. Looks like we got a decent amount of eliminations like in the ring. Andrade's already out of here. Hook is safe, but way up in the air there. Neville. I'm pretty sure I just pushed that down. He's going to be safe. Keith Lee on top of Lindsay right there, safe. Dan Housen. Okay, this foot was down. I don't know. This foot, the one I'm holding was down, but this foot, obviously, the one I'm tapping is still up. You can see that, so he's going to be safe. Xavier Woods, he's been here before, right? He's played this game. Buddy Matthews, I think. Was he up? Did he fall back a little bit? I don't know if he would have been up, though. That's. I'll give it to him. That looks like there's still a little movement there. We'll give it to him. Let's say Dorado, while his feet are up, the calves are down pretty... I'm not... Uh, I'll try not to spin him this time. His calves are pretty down. You guys... Well... 
That one actually isn't. That one is not. He is going to be safe. Eddie Kingston, very safe. Wes Lee, this foot has been up for a while. Yeah, that's that's definitely safe. I can't get into these guys yet because I think it's going to affect this pile. So let's start checking down here. Looks like Oos. The Oos is loose and the... Was that... Was that up? And I pushed it down because it... now it's not moving at all. I, I think this is first round. We're going to be generous. It's first round. We're always generous on first round. Daniel Bryan Danielson is going to be leaving us. Ali, I think that's way up. Yeah, that's way up. Sammy Guevara, obviously, is safe. We've got a lot of guys safe here. I'm just going to reach in and grab them. I'm not going to name off all the names because there's a lot here. You guys can see. I was like, oh my gosh, these guys are all clearly, well, so you guys can see, these guys are all very clearly safe. And now Batista was up before he just twisted and fell. I think I got that on camera so you could see that he was up and safe. Looks like Nick Jackson is, um, Matt Jackson is safe. Adam Page. Yeah, that's up. That is up, but I don't think Karrion Cross. you were down. And we moved him off of you, to, but you were definitely down and out. So there, guys, has not been a lot. There was not a lot of movement there. We have a very small eliminations pile. So that's uh, that's got to change this round. All right, here's our field of competitors. They all have their field of dreams to win this championship. And let's see what happens. Three, two, one. Oh, that was pretty solid. Get, you guys can't just hang on to the sword forever. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know you think it's safe, but it's not that safe. We're going to have to move this board out of the danger zone here. Uh, let's see here. We've got Great Kali who will... Yeah, he's going to be leaving us, but Junkyard Dog took one last ride to with Kali to kind of stay alive there. We've got Kenny Omega who will be... No, that's just in the leg. Yeah, Kenny Omega will be forfeiting the title. Sorry, Kenny. No repeat championship. Um, going to put you up there so I don't forget to take your title off. Now let's look at the field. Looks like Hook is going to be out of here. Ricky Steamboat is safe. We've got Dan Housen. Who, that foot looks like that is up. That is clearly up right there. This one is up, and also Keith Lee wrapping his leg on top to also not be eliminated. You guys are working together. That's teamwork. Neville is out of here. Let's say Dorado safe. Xavier Woods, he had two feet down. They were both down, and then he shifted a little bit when we moved. Eddie Kingston is safe. That foot's up. Wes Lee safe. Up here again, guys. I think I'm just gonna have to grab some of these people without disturbing the pile. Just grab some people who are clearly safe, have their feet up. That way, we can get a better look at the ones who are in jeopardy. There we go. Moved the pile, didn't disturb anything. Buddy Matthews, look at that. That's a heads up play right there. However, Mustafa Ali taking a fall. Looks like Sammy Guevara. I think that's down. No, that that look that's up. That's actually up. It looks down, but that's actually up. That's not just the figure leg moving. That's there's space there. So Sammy Guevara, who was licking Jay Uso's boot, uh, Ali is out, and Buddy Matthews, Buddy Murphy is alive. Jay, you're definitely out that time. You were probably out the first time, but I just. Wanted to be sure. Let's move the cape. I think Hurricane's obviously safe, right? Yeah, he's definitely safe. His feet are way up there on top of everybody. Let's move him. We've got Luchasaurus and Adam Page, both safe. However, it looks like Matt Jackson will be leaving us. And it looks like Batista also going to be leaving. Thank you guys for showing up. Thanks for playing. Now we're down to about half the field. So there we go. New champion will be crowned. Let's see who it is. All right, this is one 
big long line of competitors here. They kind of had to fit in however I could get them to sit in there. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, oh, yeah, we just, we launched. Matt Riddle just got launched. Sorry, Matt, you uh, thought I was going to need a lot of force for that, just because it just was, there were so many people. So let's take a look here. Keith Lee. That's going to be an elimination. So I think you you kind of knew that's why you jumped over here. Lex Luger also going to be eliminated. That's two feet down touching. Eddie Kingston got two heels planted. Ricky Steamboat has a foot up right there. Safe. Wesley Lindsay Dorado safe. Looks like Buddy Matthews, Buddy Murphy safe. That foot is up. Farouk and X-Pac also safe. And Sammy Guevara safe back there. I think everyone here is safe for the most part from what I'm seeing. Dexter Loomis is safe. Look, yeah, it looks like a lot of these people are safe. We're just going to start moving them up. I think there's a lot of people here that are safe. This whole pile was safe. Mark Henry is safe on top of Hurricane Dan Housen. Really safe back here. Let's move him. Adam Page safe. J is everyone safe? Hurricane potential. No, Hurricane's got a foot that you guys can see my finger. That's safe. Looks like Luchasaurus might be out of this. But other than that, I think everyone was pretty safe. Yeah, Luchasaurus has some toes touching, so we only lost, I think, three or four that round. That wasn't very... We launched Riddle, and then lost, you know, like, three or four after that, and we gotta get a more productive elimination round. Alright, here we go. Oh, guys, I, I do remember, this was supposed to be a Nerf Rocket elimination, like, game. Uh, but the Nerf rocket is in surgery right now. We are super gluing it back together. So hopefully we can do one of those here soon where we can just use the Nerf rocket. Um, but after playing around and doing some tests and stuff, we, we had to put it through surgery. Uh, we broke off one of the fins. But it is okay. It's recovering. And hopefully it'll be uh, usable again here soon. So in honor of Nerf rocket, this round... I'm just going to try and slice through everybody. Like, I'm going to try and do, instead of, like, slicing up to them to knock them off, I'm just going to try and slice through everybody. So we could have a lot of people go flying this round. Here we go. Three, two, one. There was my kind of slice through. Tried to keep it calm a little bit, but as you can see, we've got more guys who went flying this way. For some reason, in the middle and, like, the back didn't do too much. Anyway... Oh, no way. That's He is still alive. Man, Lindsay Dorado is a really good character to have here. Ricky Steamboat is okay. Sammy Guevara, okay. But X-Pac, man, you've got both your toes touching the top of the platform. Not the smartest move. We've got to give you an elimination for that. Wesley... That, I think that's just movement in the knee pad because it looks like, yeah, that's only movement in the knee pad, I think, is what we're looking at there because that's clearly down. The heel's not down. The calf, I think, is down. I don't know. That's that's really close to call. Let's see if I can see anything from here. Is that calf down? That looks like that is down. Yeah, we're just pushing on the, you guys can see when we zoom in from back here, you can see we're just pushing down on that mat. So that is going to be an elimination. That will be an elimination here for Wes Lee. I just want to make sure I, I zoomed in and got the full specs before we eliminated. Farouk is out. And it looks like we still have a lot of people safe here. Looks like everyone else back here has at least one foot in the air. So you know what I think we're going to start doing? What if we just do, if one foot is down, you're out. 
What do you guys say to that? Huh? You want to start playing by the rules? Or should we make some new rules? Let's see. All right, so here we go. We've got, I don't know if you guys have ever met Lexi Ray. This is our, our uh, Alexa Bliss cat, named after my wife's favorite wrestler, Alexa Bliss. Of course, uh, she's now going to make her YouTube debut. Thank you, Lex, for joining and possibly ruining what's what we're doing here. Anyway, um, so yeah, I'm trying to threaten the guys here. If no one wants to get eliminated proper this round, we might look at just, if one foot's down, eliminating them. Uh, just to kind of, you know, kind of kind of start to wrap this thing up, right? Like, this is, this is a lot of competitors for this late in the game. So, here we go. Three, two, one. Give them all a little knock here. Let's see. Thank you, Lex. We're, we're trying to... Try and check out our competitors here. We've got Dexter Loomis, who's got a foot down and a foot up. Buddy Murphy, Murphy Matthews is eliminated clean. Junkyard Dog eliminated properly. We, we might not have to do the foot up, foot down thing. Rick Steamboat is out. These guys all went to the pit. Okay, we're not doing the one foot up, one foot down thing. I think I should patch this. This is getting, uh, the concave is getting worse and worse because I don't have anything under there. Maybe I'll put a board under there or something. Okay, we're not going to do the one foot up, one foot down. Dexter, you're still safe. Mark Henry's still safe. Adam Page is safe. But is Dan Housen, is that, there, there's movement there, I think. Well, when I lift him up, then he's definitely safe. Oh, that, so the coat is really helping Dan Housen. Because if nothing lands on top of his feet, he's basically, f oh, he might be a technicality character. We might have to take him out of, out of rumbles after this one. We might have to switch out our Dan Housens. I thought this would be the better one to use, but maybe not. Anyway, that's, so we've got, we've got a lot of eliminations that round. We're down to four. Potentially this is a finale, but you know, I like to be at, at two or three to do a true finale. So here we go. Let's get down to our final two or final three. Three, two, one. Just a nice sweepums right there. Dexter Loomis is still. I don't know how you're staying safe for so long. Mark Henry is no way. I think I pushed it down. He was wobbling a little bit, guys. I think he's safe. No way. Everyone is safe. Okay. Okay, we'll do one more one more round with these four and see what happens. Okay, this is our last go around with these four. Uh, if no one's eliminated here, we're just we might have to do the look at the one foot option. Three, two, one. Give them all a little, a little go. There, let's see. Dexter Loomis. I just pushed that down. That was up again. Somehow, he survives. Adam Page is eliminated. Mark Henry is eliminated clean. And Dan Housen is up right there. We've got our finale, finally. It's a top rope orange and AGF. The amazingly... Great Fanaranians. Did I say that right? Did I say that right this time, Branson? I think it's Fanaranians. Last time I said Fanaranians uh, because I was thinking Mandalorian in my head, so I wanted to pronounce it that way, so I just said Fanaranians. I think it's... or Fan Fanaranians. Now I don't know what I said and what's right. I don't know. I don't remember. Branson, please help me. Uh, I think it's Fanar... Rainians, I believe I'm now pronouncing that correctly. Anyway, point is, you guys are going to the finale with Dan Housen. Top Rope Orange is going to the finale with Dexter Lo Loom. I need two hands to set this figure up. Uh, and we'll see just what we get here.
and our new United States Champion, sponsored by the Treasure Trove Toy Store. Who would have guessed it? It's Dexter Loomis. Never would have thought in my wildest dreams that this figure would be winning a championship. One, it's a basic. How? Uh, although, I can't knock basics. Their leg movement is kind of optimal for this. As long as they don't land directly like up and down or teals, like toes touching, heels touching. So, hey, congratulations, De Dexter Loomis. Uh, watch out, Dan Helsen. Looks like he might be trying to cast a spell on you. Anyway, guys, we'll see you next time. Bye!